It was a very good day indeed for UCLA men's and women's track and field teams as they were victorious on home turf over Arizona and Washington State. I'm Paul Sunderland along with Jerome Davis and Tom Fewer. And there were some really solid performances and maybe none better than C.J. Allen from Washington State in the 400 meter hurdles. He looked fluid, he looked strong, and despite the fact that he said he can't train in the snow, he ran a 50.55 in the 400 meter hurdles, which will stand up as one of the top times in the country this year. Said he didn't like to train in the snow, and for UCLA, the reason they won was because of some good sprint performance is Jerome particularly from Leon Powell a look at his hundred meter victory he said he was just really working on his dry phase but you can see he's in full form running moving his arms he looks great what a what a phenomenal race he had especially early in the season so Leon Powell the winner for the Bruins at hundred meters and then it was Kylie Price back in action for the first time in over a year and a half and she got the day started with a really phenomenal uh, equaling a personal best in the long jump, albeit wind aided. She had two jumps, one at 21-4 and three quarters, and 21-4 and a quarter, both of which were outstanding performances, one wind legal, one wind aided, and she has picked up where she left off two years ago. And then back that up in the 100 meters where she is really a stylish runner, Tom. She looks world class. Yeah, she looks phenomenal. I mean, one of the things you gotta realize with her is that she knows how to run, and when you watch her run, she was born to run and I'm just glad she came out of here especially coming off an of injury this is a confidence booster for her moving forward the first look at outdoor track and field here on the Pac-12 network much more to come coming up this Saturday actually at USC on the 26th at 3 30 Pacific time for Tom Fuhr, Jerome Davis Andrea Avon I'm Paul Sunderland thanks for joining us here track and field coverage on the Pac-12 network